How you doing? Huh, Rebs? Benny, you coming? I love to watch John T's vlog on Facebook, baby. Bring it. Hey, guys. I'm in my living room sitting on my stripper stage behind my stripper pole. And today I want to talk to you about this bill for, against the gentlemen's clubs. Now, it's coming up for its final appeal in February. And even though the forecast looks extremely ominous for the gentlemen's clubs, and it looks that this bill will stand and the appeal will fail, I want everybody to take three minutes out of their day to go and email their congressman or their representative, re representative asking them to inspire some new legislation that could overturn such a bill. Or, now, I do realize we need to understand that the gentlemen's clubs have failed to embrace the new media way of marketing and only embrace the old media way of marketing, which has created a political Christian witch hunt, which inspired some incredible legislation that was carefully crafted with language that would not offend the First Amendment which is now <clears throat> about to stamp out the after dark industry. Now Kansas City or any state in the Union cannot thrive without the after dark industry. We do need this. The economic downturn of this that may take three to five years to f completely full have the effects of it is definitely against the American spirit. No state in the Union has ever thrived financially ever without the after dark industry. The after dark industry has been here before the Old West and has been here long after the Old West. It's as American way as guns. To lose this flavor of the American spirit is extremely socialist. It's not a Christian way. It is a non-Christian way. Kansas City is full of good people, good values, and good beliefs. Unfortunately, because of this piece of legislation, we are now going to have to get back to ourselves. I ask all of you, please, take three minutes out of your day and send a quick email off stating, one paragraph long, how un-American and how socialist such a piece of legislation is and asking for some new inspiring legislation that could rezone the after dark industry. Well, I'm John T, and thanks again, Kansas City. Hey guys, that's my rant for today. Um, anyway, I want to tell you real quickly about a, uh, a gal I found that does voiceover work for websites and internet shows, Tammy Rader. She's really incredible. Um, I'll put her a link for her website down below here. She, uh, she's $50 for a 30 second spot or $25 for a 15 second spot. Um, she is our Ted Williams, except for she's not a raging alcoholic, but she's really good. And she's a Kansas City girl. <clears throat> so please go show her the Kansas City love. So let's support our local industry and artist. Um, if you have a website, you want some work, or you want to put some bling on your website, hit her up. So, all right, guys, for day 149, I'm out. And peace in the Middle East. I'm John T. I love to watch John T's vlogs on Facebook.